Hey guys, um, Kingdom Hearts 3 is coming out, you know, after like a year or so. So I figured I'd throw in my top 10 wants and hopes for Kingdom Hearts 3. None of these are in any particular order, so just take them as they come. Alright, so let's get started with my top 10. Number 10. To start off my list, um, my number 10th is I want bigger worlds because I, as much as I enjoy going through all the Disney worlds and, and exploring and everything, you know, it, it's it, it's more like a, a, a like it's a mini game than it's a like a full level in itself. I mean, I, I guess they fixed that with with like uh, Dream Drop Distance. I mean, the worlds are much bigger in that one. But you know, I would like uh, you know bigger worlds than even Dream Drop Distance. Number nine. For my number nine, what I would like in uh, Kingdom Hearts 3 is, you know, more worlds. Y you know, there are a lot of worlds as there is. I think I heard from someone say that there is like 40 worlds that in all of the Kingdom Hearts series that we visited so far. But you know what? I would like like 60 worlds all in one game. You know, instead of just spending them out in multiple areas, and not, and not just that, but have like all the reoccurring worlds and everything. Uh, yeah, we've kind of like burnt up all the storylines for the actual Disney games, as is, uh, you know, like Ariel from The Little Mermaid uh, has already, you know, met her prince and you know grown legs. But what about using like the second movie, as bad as it was? Number eight. I want a longer story. Alright, and, and, and I don't just mean, oh, well, it's like a 20 hour story. No, I want like a Final Fantasy 400 hour story. Alright, I want it to go on. I want it to explain everything. I want all it, uh, loose ends tied up. I want it to feel completely satisfied that I spent half of my adult life playing the entirety of the series, going out and buying games I didn't have the money for, and playing it to it the full extent that I'm 100% satisfied, I can set my controller down, and I can take the breath that I've been meaning to take for the last, what, nine years. Number seven. You know what I really, really want for the game? Like, a five-character selection. You know, like they had in Birth by Sleep with three-character selections between Terra, Aqua, and Ventus? Well, I want that, but with five characters. I want Roxas. I want him to have his own storyline in the game. I, uh, Sora, Riku, uh, Mickey, I don't know, maybe you could even play as uh, Terra or Xehanort. You know, like a bad guy as part of the story. See everything from his perspective. Like, wouldn't that be interesting? Like, wouldn't that be just like the, the, the cherry on the, the Sunday of awesomeness? Number six! Okay, I want tons and tons of replayability. Alright, think of any Kingdom Hearts game you've played. Birth by Sleep, excluding Birth by Sleep. Alright, so you, you play through the entire game and then you, you don't really feel compelled to play through it again right after you're done. I mean, maybe if your 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 mind just blown up because of the story twist at the end, you might play it again. Say, Dream Drop Distance. But, typically, they don't have as much replayability as I would like. I mean, trust me, I've replayed the Kingdom Hearts games a billion times, but still, like, immediate replayability, that's what I want. Number five. Hey, have you guys heard that in Kingdom Hearts 3, your Keyblades will be able to transform into different weapons like guns or an axe or whatever? Well, that leads me to my new number five. Um, I want lots of Keyblades. And I mean lots. I mean, I want every Keyblade from the entire game series shoved into this one game. And I want extras. I want more. I want ones I couldn't, I haven't even thought of or heard about. You know, I just want it all jam packed in there. And you know what? Having some of the Organization 13's weapons as some of your weapons, 
that would be pretty bitchin' too. Number four! You know what I would like in Kingdom Hearts 3? I'd like to be able to first-person combat. Now, a lot of you might be thinking, oh, well, Kingdom Hearts is a third-person game, you know, that doesn't make much sense. But, if you think about it, up from, even until Kingdom Hearts 1, you know, they had first-person view, I mean, just push the select button and you can look around. And in Kingdom Hearts 2, they took that even further, and you push select and you can look around and even go into combat in the first-person mode. Now, it, it wasn't built specifically to do that, so it didn't work very well, but if you wanted to play it in a first-person view, it's pretty cool that you could. And for number three, I would really like to have, you know, push select, and you can go into a first-person mode, and it being full useful, and being able to, like, show your health gauge, and your magic gauge, and your command list while in first-person mode. Number three. For my number three, I would really like to have more background characters, because, you know, you're entering like huge towns sometimes and you come across like three four fucking people in the entire town that aren't part of the main storyline and you know I'd like more background characters and I'd like to be able to interact with more people you know as opposed to just there being like two fucking people you can talk to number two, 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 two. what's my number two well I'll tell you fully functioning characters at all times and by this I mean when you play the game and you are looking at the the main storyline character from a distance you you might notice that their face looks wrong it, it doesn't look right and then they zoom in on the face and the face looks you know really well uh, really well made but it just doesn't quite look right at a distance, and and I'm guessing they do that to save time or or money or effort. But you know, I'd like that to be completely fixed once they they make Kingdom Hearts three. No 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 no. And at last, my number one. You know, my number one, I know I said all of these weren't in order, but my number one is officially my number one want for Kingdom Hearts 3. And that is all boss fights from all of the game series packed in to one area. Say, like the Mirage Marina from uh, Birth by Sleep have every single boss fight from every single Kingdom Hearts game packed into one area where you can take them out one by one. That would be awesome. Or even maybe like a boss rush mode where you gotta kill all of them and survive through every single boss in the entire series. I'm, some of you might not agree, but that's my list. Um, please comment, you know, rate, subscribe, and uh, I will try and keep bringing you some A quality videos. Thanks for watching. Bye. Or should I say, bye. 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 bye.